Left the game. <laughs> Kaisa, DC'd. I don't have stacks. Rengar, let's let's do it. Oh, I have five stacks. Something's fishy. Hey guys, I'm Shark back doing a how to play Irelia top where we're going to be going over how to play the early, mid, and late game, how to team fight, when to split push and carry every single one of your games. So, like usual, if you enjoy, find it helpful, smash the like, comment, subscribe. Those are the runes you take conquer. And some people take a clarity with Cope de Grace, but in reality, Last Stand and Bloodline has the higher win rates of the two. Inspiration secondary. And we're playing against Lucian, which means, uh, yeah, pre-6, he just dumpsters on us. Ugh. My camera's acting funny, but I'll fix that later. We just have to kind of, you know, chillax. Wait until, I don't even want to say level 3. He beats us level 3. We have to wait until we have uh, ultimate or before we start building into Blade of the Rune King. We can't fall behind, right? If we can go even, great, but realistically speaking, he's probably going to beat us uh, early on, especially when he can E our E ability. If I can get five stacks... It, We have five stacks. Yes! Bah, oh, biscuit. I'm gonna back. Here? I think the wave... Dang. You know what's funny? I knew that was coming, but like, I didn't do anything about it. <sighs> no, no, no. Dang, I, I I didn't want the wave to, to freeze near him because it's shoving back towards him. Is it? No, it's shoving back towards me. Oh my. Okay, we're building into Blade. No, it's uh, shoving towards him. Nah, it's going to shove back towards me though. Yes, we're building towards Blade. Blade first item, Triforce second. That's like the most standard thing you can do. Maybe if I... Maybe I'll fix it. I'll fix the settings later. I'll oh, forget it. Okay. Yes. Blade first. Try for second. And uh, da -da, Death Dance third. If we're snowballing. And yeah, we have to look for moments like that where we have five stacks on our passive. And, you know, minions are low. We could Q quickly to them. Get the five stacks and then try to make a play onto the Lucian that if we land our e our q reset so we can use it twice and that's how you want to actually play it out play off your passive and when they step up like that even if he ease my q i can q again if i land my e so yeah he cannot escape basically and these you gotta note these correct timings when to go in or else well you'll lose the early game and die and when you lose the early game you'll be useless basically so five stacks okay it doesn't matter it's shoving under his tower and he probably doesn't want to take a trade here yep he's just gonna get shoved under tower there and now we could start building towards our juicy Blade of the Rune King. We need Boots to head back to lane quicker. And for him not to kite us out so much. And the Vision Ward. Because as we saw, Warwick uh, sometimes comes top. And that's an issue we need to fix. So let's get that Vision Ward. He sh she tried to freeze? I mean, he semi-did it. But eventually, yeah. Wave control is all in our favor. I'm gonna place the vision there because I doubt he's gonna be able to clear it. Right now we have Pryo. T 
See, he's too close to tower. That's why, like... Our W negates his damage, just note that. But like, that's why the wave has to be shoving towards us at all points. Or like, frozen near our tower, or else he just has so much, you know, room to just fall back if I'm playing aggressive, or actually play aggressive when he finds opportunity. I can't. He could just E away from my R. But I do want to look for a tower dive. Kind of risky, but if I land the R. Ah, okay. I landed the R and my Q reset because I landed it. I could Q twice. So, like, I feel like I fumbled a little bit. Mashed my buttons a little bit. But as you can see, that's how you want to pick up these leads. Like I said, playing off of opponent's mistakes and now we could recall and start picking up um cutlass with a dagger that's pretty good oh silas is top is he switching no he just wanted to roam three long swords to my cutlass and dagger on top of that well he took the four potions but generally speaking i have more no i don't want to save right now more sustain because of lifesteal and potions. Okay. We're gonna try to freeze. Here, our tower. I mean, he's kind of playing up a little bit. A little bit. I'm at one stack, so like... Looking for a trade is really not ideal here. Uh, uh, only when we get the five stacks. See, we have Cutlass. So like... Have fun kiting that, you know? Conqueror stacks all the way charged up. We still have five stacks. We're using that as bait if he steps up a little bit. And he's not going to step up. Okay. I don't have R, so I don't want to look for a tower dive. Instead, we saw Warwick was topside. Place a deep ward and then see if we could scout out Scuttle. But I mean, Silas is rotating along with him, so like... Yeah, we don't want to mess with that. Map awareness. Okay, that's going to be a deep ward at river. Because he cleared my vision. How could you? He's going to heal up because of his potions. But... I mean, yeah, we're winning this lane really hard. Really hard. Hmm... Can I get the five stacks? Oh, I had to flash out. And I think I could... No, I can't. My five stacks are going to run out if the Warwick shows. It is possible for me to fight him, though. I'm going to take a tower plating, not overstay and try to take two because that's too greed. Is that going to be enough? Yep, enough for blade. And that's like the power spike we look for. But oof, okay, Warwick's at Rift. Yeah, he's taking an objective. Rengard's a day four-man bot. They did him dirty. Okay, let's get the uh, Blade of the Rune King here. Vision Ward because Warwick. And uh, yeah, hmm. I don't know, uh, if I play it correctly, we could possibly 1v2 if, oh, I think they switched. Did they switch? I mean, it's Lucian and Silas. They're both flex picks. Yeah, they switched. Um, I might get Merc. Nah, I need Ninja Tabby. But, uh, how am I going to deal with the Silas? He got arm Arms Guards 2. Level 8 to level 8. Well. Silas. I don't even care if I don't have 5 stacks. I kind of just win this. Because of my Blade of the Rune King Power Spike. Like, no joke. As soon as you pick up that item, you're really able to 1v1. Like, I want to say Blade... Uh, Blade is like your strongest point of the game. Because generally speaking, you're for the early. Right? Early to mid game. But after you pick up Blade, you have so much potential to 1v1. Almost everyone. 
even without your uh, five stacks on your passive. Just gotta land your R, maybe your E, and uh, yeah, you're chilling. Okay. I'm gonna shove this in, right? And then look to recall. Oh, shoot. I think he saw me. And then because we don't want to overstay. I don't know if he's going to try to stop me. Yeah. No. Uh, boots of choice. Uh, for the Silas, we, I feel like we have to run the Mercs. And then, of course, getting Triforce second. They have a lot of auto attackers, I know. But I don't know. CC, along with us matching against Silas. This could be the best choice here. And Lucian's... Uh, Lucian's not doing too too bad mid when it comes to the, uh, playing versus the Talon, which I hate to see. But if they switch again, that's going to be a rip. That's going to be a rip. Nah, well, I mean, Lucian is really, really behind, so I'm not too worried about that. But my Merc Treads, that's a waste of 800 gold. Let's see. Is anyone going to show? Okay, Lucian's mid. Silas is mid. He tried to roam. So that's easy tower platings for us. Oh, what they're trying to do is fight for drag, and I don't have TP. Okay, we're going to let go of drag. I'm pretty sure we lost that. Yep. Yeah. But what we're going to do is actually get first tower. We should be able to. Yeah. Let go of drag. Take first tower. Warwick's fed. Rip. But I mean, eh? Let's see. If we can do it. We have to clear this quickly. And it's a cannon wave. So if we can get this under tower. That's going to give us enough time to actually take it especially with our five stacks giving us attack speed oof how did lucian solo the rengar see that behind yep my e missed oof no my q can reset though He cocked me. I think Warwick's coming top. Oh, no, he's bot. Nah, Silas! He dodged my E! <laughs> it was literally all in my E. If I landed the E, he would have been dead. I want Sheen so badly. But Phage. Oh, Phage. Sheen will help a lot. With, uh, nah. Sheen is such a good buy, though. It's fine. I, I prefer the Phage. And yeah, I think the win condition is probably split pushing. Probably. Because we, we, we can beat the Silas. It's just we misplayed that a little bit right now. And we didn't have, uh, we didn't back with our gold we got from, from Tower. And we're strong. We're still strong. We're strong up until like the 25 minute mark. And then. Our damage, I guess, becomes kind of meh. And we quote-unquote fall off. But, uh... Until then. Yeah. I have five stacks. Okay, we're flashing. Wow, I accidentally hit his... Our... His ultimate wall. Which he stole from me. Okay, Warwick, you want to fight this out? It's really hard to fight Aurelia, especially once she... Oh, man, her Q healing along with Blade. And on top of that, you might get Death Dance. Jeez. Golly, you know? If Warwick shows, I might be dead, though. <laughs> nah, he's mid. He's mid. <clears throat> I think Silas is uh, coming top. But his tower might be gone by then. If I had to guess. Now we're just going to queue out. Ooh. 
Ooh. Irelia. <sighs> okay. Triforce here. And uh, that dance third item. You could also go Black Cleaver, which is kind of weird because you have two phages. But it works really well with Irelia. Um... Yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to actually carry this solo. But I'm, you know, I'm cool with. I'm cool with. Let's see. Let's see. Just bait it. Bait it. Pretend like, you know, you are helpless, right? Now watch me Q here. Okay. W there. You're dead. Dang. Didn't know she had uh, enough. We have to ult the back one. How dare she dodge it? What did I want to say? I, for I honestly forgot. Wow. Uh, lost train of thought, I think. Let me get these. Look top, look mid. Mm, why are we all hugging bot? I think top tower is gone too. I did the right play. It's just my team kind of just like... Did random things. So drag and rift are up. I do want to fight for third drag. Because it's third dragon, uh, it's infernal. We don't want to trade Rift for drag here at all. And if Ball oh my, I think Bot's gonna die. That's so sad. Let me get the reset off. Wowzer. Okay, we're talent. You showed top when Rift when drag is up. They got dragged just because you showed top. Come on, man. All right. Literally, I don't even think we can trade. You came too late and you don't even have uh, Mobis. Ugh. Okay. The, you kind of uh, oh, misplayed hard. Just with like uh, macro, not really mechanics. I couldn't get, I don't think I could have made it there on time. I wish we stole it, but you know, it is what it is. Team can do as they please. I hope I could split push and eventually. I'm so glad they forfeit before 20. So that way they can't uh, forfeit. Because I'm going to say no, of course. Literally. And you're pinging me like it's my fault. League, I swear, has the most toxic community without question, without doubt. Okay, Lucian, Warwick, we saw mid. We're going to try to take tower here, in fact. Our, oh, I thought our Q one-shot the back wave. It does with Sheen, but yeah, we need the Sheen. Q that. I think we can take it. Wow, I got perma CC'd, but we took inhib, so it's worth. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Do we have enough? Nope. We're close, though. Yeah. See? Wow, we actually took a lot of pressure top. Team can... Int it, but I do think I can carry this. It's, it's not that hard. I'm Aurelia, and she literally is meant for, like, these, these 1v5 type situations uh if i could get death dance i need it so bad i'm selling corrupting because that's gonna i have sheen for the mana and a lot of life steal for health healing so the the that dance will go a really long way here fourth item probably guardian's angel is going to help me we're so ahead like we do technically fall off right but if we're always ahead in these items, in the item department, we're always going to be, you know, good to go. As long as it's us being two items ahead, we don't have to worry about falling off until they actually start matching close in items. So, if you landed that, he would have been so dead. 
Sushi. Actually. I'm trying to split. Wow, they don't understand simple calls. Oh, wait. Wowzers. Oh my, we actually carried that. What the? Wow, we actually carried that. <laughs> Yikes. That's what we call the Irelia carry. Okay. It basically is a solo carry. When you really think about it, like my team, they have meh KDA. Some of them 5-5, five, 6-5, five, five, but they they didn't do anything. They, they didn't. Let's just accept that. I should be getting four honors and uh, they should th be uh, thanking me. We, we want to recall here, actually, because we have a lot of gold. And then we could even look barren. But I don't think my team has the mental capability to uh, auto attack Baron and not fail on doing that. So, I don't know. We have to look for an awkward pick maybe at first. Uh, mm, if you guys went two for one, that would be great. But It's just me. I'm the one to carry these team fights. I think they're going to commit to that. It's like. My E shield. It's fine. Ugh. I got perma CC'd. I messed that up though. That's my fault. My bad guys. <sighs> What do we want to do here? Make sure they don't get Infernal Soul. Look to Baron, actually. We need that so bad. Get the GA. Oof. And then last item, I think Randuin's good. We could get the Titanic Hydra if we're looking to play more on the aggressive than defensive side of things. Oh my god. Like, they're actually just hardcore griefing this. Oh, well. I'm a positive player. Positive player, just like we have a positive community. I'm reporting all of them at the end of this game for feeding. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. <laughs> I'm just joking. But, uh, again, we want to look barren. Two bot. I mean, I could split mid, you know? Don't get caught. And what do you guys do? You guys get caught. I'm going to assume. They're all looking bot while I can go mid. That's good. That's actually good. Good job. They're all bot. I could take mid. And now my Q one shots the back waves. So it's really easy to get five stacks. Especially for team fights. Predicted my, uh, I think. Ah! My feelings. I have five stacks. I, I would think it would be worth to kill the Nami. Yeah. GG's. I'm pretty sure. I don't think we have minions. Do we? Take it, take it, take it, take it. Okay, we can't. No! <laughs> uh, we had opportunity and we just didn't take it. To end. Now, God. Uh, what's his face? Left the game. <laughs> Kaisa, DC'd. I don't have stacks. 
Rengar, let's let's do it. Oh, uh, I have five stacks. Hey, we got a penta kill. Okay. All right, GG well played like usual. If you enjoyed, find it helpful. Smash the like, comment, subscribe. Uh, turn on that post notification bell. Check out the Twitch. Join the Discord. And I'm out.